Yo, what's up, Kelo Kemi gente? I know you guys are used to seeing me do videos about comedy or Dominican stuff or La Mama Juana or La Vaina con la Novia Mia, you know, stuff with my girlfriend. But today I'm gonna do something a little bit different. Why? Because a brand new iPhone X came out and a lot of people are having problems putting their old iPhone restore <laughs> into the brand new iPhone X. So if this video was helpful, make sure you hit that like, subscribe, and comment below. Now let's get ready to show you how to fix your problem. Welcome back to my channel. Like I said, well, if you're anything like me, you probably got the brand new iPhone X or iPhone 10 or iPhone 5 plus 5. What happened to iPhone 9? Okay, 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 we're getting off topic. But if you did get the brand new iPhone X, either space gray or silver, and you're trying to restore your old iTunes backup from your old iPhone to your new one, you're probably encountering a corruption error or it's saying that it can't restore it to the new device because it's not compatible. All right, I'm gonna show you guys how to fix it. It's pretty simple, but complicated at the same time. So what happened is when iPhone or when Apple shipped the brand new flagship iPhone X, what it did was it shipped it with iOS 11.0.3, which is an older operating system. And if you're anything like me, you probably have your phone up to date, your old one at least, at 11.1. .1. Apple stopped a long time ago letting people put an older operating system or a newer restore onto an older operating system. So what you have to do is you have to actually update your new phone. But how can you do that when you can't even get it started? Easy. So once you start up your brand new iPhone, you're gonna go through the same process like you always do, but when it asks you do you wanna restore, just do set up new phone. Go through the same process, finish it off. After you're done setting it up, make sure it's connected to Wi-Fi, click on settings, click on general, and then software update. You're gonna see it's gonna say that there's, an op there's a software update available. Download the update and let it go through its whole process. So after it's done with the update, and you get back to your main screen, you're gonna click on settings, you're gonna click on general, then you're gonna click on erase all the way at the bottom. And you want to, or reset or restore or something like that, all the way at the bottom. And you're gonna do is erase all content and settings. And you're like, Don Jose, why would I do all this to then erase it again? Why? So that it's now a fresh factory phone with an updated operating system. So after all that is done, you're gonna go through the same process again, put your information in, and then you're gonna, when it gets to the point where it says you wanna restore from iTunes, now you can actually plug it in again and restore from backup on your iTunes. And now you should have no problem at all and your phone should be good to go. Now, if you found this video useful and helpful, and it actually helped you get past your whole iPhone worry, make sure you share it, make sure you tag a friend, make sure you hit that like button, make sure you comment and subscribe. I know it's a little different than all the videos I do, but I figured, hey, let me help you guys out because you guys always help me out, you know, you know? Okay, and speaking about iPhones, go check out my Instagram because I'm about to be doing a lot more videos with this, okay? So y'all go take care of that right quick. Hold on, let me take a bunch of selfies. Y'all can go now, y'all can go. <laughs> I, I said cut, y'all can go. Cut. <laughs> I'm looking good.